वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस वीडियो लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू ड्रॉ कंप्लीट ग्राफ ऑफ ऑर्डर फाइव ऑन टोरस ऑफ जीनस वन एज वी नो दैट के फाइव इज नॉट प्लानर वी कैन नॉट ड्रॉ के फाइव ऑन अ प्लेन बट वी कैन ड्रॉ के फाइव ऑन टोरस ऑफ जीनस वन सो फर्स्ट we understand what is torus of genus 1 torus of genus 1 is uh, basically surface of a donut if we have a donut uh, just shape like this so just considering this surface that is a surface of donut or surface of a tube tire tube is the example of torus of genus 1 torus of genus 1 so we can draw k5 on torus of genus 1 first i modify this shape if we cut this tube or torus of genus 1 at this point and separate these two edges then we will get shape like a cylinder cylindrical shape or just like a pipe this one this way now this is obtained from this torus of genus 1 this tube or a pipe like shape or a cylinder like shape is obtained from this shape now i modify this shape if i cut this pipe at this point and uh, then if i try to reshape this means if i separate upper and lower edge then we will obtain a plane like shape a shape which looks like just a plane plane so from torus of genus 1 we can obtain a plane so so this plane is a modified form of torus of genus 1 or surface of torus of genus 1 remember we are just considering the surface of this torus of genus 1 now we draw k5 on a plane remember if i join this lower edge to the upper edge and this left edge to the right edge i will again get a surface like torus of genus 1 so from torus of genus 1 we can get a plane and from a plane we can get a torus a uh, surface of genus 1 or torus of genus 1 so now we try to sketch k5 graph on this plane now consider five vertices 1 2 3 4 and 5 so our vertex 1 vertex 2 vertex 3 vertex 4 and vertex 5 now we need to find a complete graph we we try to a complete graph in which every vertex is connected to other vertex so first i join these vertices 1 and 2 2 and 3 4 and 3 5 and 4 5 and 1 remember edge crossing is not allowed so avoid edge crossing now we can join 5 and 3 up till now there is no edge crossing now we can also join 5 with 2 or vertex 1 to vertex 3 so i join vertex 1 to vertex 
3. Now, we need to connect vertex 1 to all other vertices. Vertex 1 is connected to vertex 2. Vertex 1 is connected to 3. Vertex 1 is connected to 5. Now, we need to connect vertex 1 and vertex 4. So, I draw an edge this edge and call it x and from here I draw another edge and call it x. Remember this is one edge. If we will join this lower edge to the upper edge, this x will meet this x. So it is exactly one edge which joins vertex 1 and vertex 4. Similarly, we need to connect this vertex 2 as vertex 2 is connected to 3 vertex 2 uh, needs a connection with vertex 5 and vertex 2 needs a connection with vertex uh, 4 and vertex 5 so first we draw an edge and call it as y now we connect this vertex 2 with vertex 5 so I draw in edge y from 4 so this edge will meet this edge and at whole it will become one edge if we join this lower edge of plane to this upper edge of the plane now we need to join one another edge as 3 is connected to 1 3 is connected to 2 3 is connected to 5 so 3 is connected to all of other vertices but a vertex 2 need another connection with vertex 5 now we connect vertex 2 uh, to vertex 5 so I draw an edge called this as edge Z and we have to join 2 to 5 so this is our edge z remember when we will join this lower edge to the upper edge upper and lower edge and this left edge to the right edge this y will meet this y and it will become one edge only Similarly, this x will meet this x. So, this x is actually one edge and similarly, this z is one edge. So, in this way, we can draw K5 graph on surface of torus of genus 1. So, K5 graph is planar on torus of genus 1, but K5 cannot be drawn on a plane.